Facebook has launched a new feature called Video Chat. What this allows you to do is three people can have a video conversation in real time with each other, so you and two other people can do this. Now they've partnered with Skype, and this isn't uh, new technology or anything. This technology's been around for a while. Skype's been around for quite a few years. It's just new to Facebook. So what you can do now is you'll be able to talk with your friends on Facebook, and it uses the Skype engine. Now, a lot of people don't have Skype and things like that, and uh, Skype might not be simple to some of the Facebook users because, well, there's all kinds of Facebook users on there, right? My mom, she only really knows how to use Facebook and navigate around it. She can't really do anything else, let alone, you know, use Skype. So this feature is going to be simply integrated into Facebook to allow these you know, people to talk back and forth and things like that. And uh, I think it's good. It's long overdue. We know that Facebook had the wall, you know, and then you had the, the typing, instant messaging, and photos and things like that to share. Now people will be able to connect with old friends and family across the world and stuff with real-time uh, video and audio, which is great. What better time? We know that uh, Google Plus has launched with their Hangout, which allows up to 10 people at once, but right now Skype is only doing three. In the future you might see more where you can do more conferencing like the new Google Hangout is doing. Now, this is great. This is awesome. You know, uh, I do have some concern, and that is for us Canadians, the fact that uh, unlimited internet is slowly disappearing and caps are coming in place. And uh, for those that don't know, Skype can be a bandwidth hog. And, uh, you know, the same thing is going to be accepted with Facebook because of that. So people may end up going through their caps depending on how much they use a Facebook chat, you know, just like Skype. So that may be an issue there. And, uh, you know, if you have a low cap, well, you'll probably eat through it. It depends on how much you're going to use uh, the, the Facebook video chat. But that's what it is. Skype is a bit of a hog and it's expected that Facebook is too. So that part's probably going to have to be sorted because if you have a low cap and you're on Facebook video chat all the time, you're going to end up, you know, going over that. And I can see that happening because that'll be the new form of communication. You know, doing video chats and things like that. So yeah. Well, there you have it, my thoughts on Facebook video chat. If you have questions, please feel free to email questions at magatech.net or leave a comment or video response. I seriously want to know what you guys think of this because, you know, with the launch of Google Plus and things like that too, you know, they'll probably work side by side, no problem, right? You know, I'm on both Facebook and Google Plus. But it is a great new feature added to Facebook. So yeah, let me know what you think. Check out our other videos at youtube.com forward slash Macintech. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you enjoy our videos. And we'll chat at you later.